Master Abdiel, there's something I want to talk about. Yes, boy. What is it? Well, um, we're about to start the episode and all, but I just want to ask, don't you think it's kind of, like, really interesting how we'll always find, like, in any kind of fiction or any kind of media, we'll always find someone to simp over? What does that mean, simp? Well, it's just, anytime there's, like, any cute girl or a cute guy that we can, like, turn into something really, like, really out there, don't you think it's a little bit too much? She's like, the Lord does not believe in these kinds of things. Why are you persisting on this tangent? It's just, well, because, like, I really like you, and I'm scared that, like, if I talk more about you, people, like, I don't know, turn you into a darker, like, I don't know how to describe it, but I have... Like, this is the point where Dazai is, like, struggling to confess his feelings to Abdiel, and my guy's just like, I should probably leave. This is getting a little, ooh, this is getting a little awkward here. Nonetheless, hello, hello, viewers. Well, that was another random tangent. I told you I'd be back for more of here in this beautiful ruined world. Of, oh, I can't turn the camera. In Shimagami Tensei 5, I told you, I told you I'd be back. I be told you I'd be doing more of this cutscene. I didn't do, you didn't miss anything, viewers, other than me just being like, I need to take a break. I need to get some food in me. It had to be done. I got some snacks. I got a refresher on the drinks. I am pumped and ready for more. And I hope you guys are ready for it too. For those that want to recap of our last adventure, uh, we got into the castle. I mean, honestly, I guess the biggest thing was us dealing with some of the puzzles. Chernobog sucked. I've been on a big rant about the Philips CDI. But we're here. And we're better. At least I think so. Got some new demons. And we started doing this cutscene because Daza was like, wow, you go, Akira. You're awesome. And then Abdi was like, hmm, I suppose he is okay. But he is not all that. Which makes me... Mind, she kind of gives me kind of like Dr. Dragon vibes a little bit, but whatever. Regardless, before I begin any further, and I know you guys definitely love hearing him more than me, so, Algami, we're starting a brand new episode. Would you mind doing the honors? I would be more than delighted to, young man. For those that wish to hear a young vitamin's voice and other materials, or wish to support his endeavors, you may please follow, like, and subscribe to his YouTube with the handle of VitaminDGR. For those who are on the social media form known as Twitch, you may like and subscribe. By subscribing, you can avoid his ads, as well as show some support to him. Nonetheless, you know you are in the right place when you see the love of dog. Will that suffice, young man? You sound a little bit more robotic there when, uh... Is everything okay, Algami? I apologize. I was merely refreshing my memory boosters. <laughs> uh, Algami? Hello? Algami? You, you in there? I want to imagine, like, I'm saying this, like, I'm tapping my ear. Because you know how when my main protagonist, like, puts a hand over his ear to talk to him? I want to imagine, like, I'm doing this, Algami's not talking, and these two are just like, What is he doing? It's like, he has become a heretic. A heretic. Strike him down for the Lord. Nonetheless, like Algami stated, like and subscribe, follow, let's just get to it. Once we take down the Demon King, Tokyo and the rest of the world will finally be safe. Right? Welcome back, Risotto. Welcome back, Foil. For those that don't know, Risotto and Foil have both jumped on chat. In that case, let me help. Even if it does mean putting myself in danger, I'll give it everything I've got. I understand you are eager to walk the path of righteousness in the service of our Lord. But good intent does not guarantee good outcome. What does that mean? That means you are, to be quite frankly, with you. You are useless. The only thing good about you is you have a surprisingly good fashion sense, but nonetheless, you are irritatingly annoying. You, wait, I have a good fashion sense? As one that can speak myself, I quite frankly like my uniform choice. It is quite revealing. I was referring to its color scheme. Oh, yeah, that, that, that too, I guess. You are merely fodder for the Demon King's foot soldiers as you are now. Damn, put him down further, why don't you? Turning back here will surely save your life and ease the heart of your friend. <laughs> and my guy's just like, actually, I, I didn't really care that much if Dazai like does this. Like, I already, I already lost two of them. I don't really care all that much for Dazai. And Dazai's just like, dude, I'm right here. Like what? I'm being honest. Oh, I was hoping I could come with. 
but she's right. I'd only end up getting in your way. Guess I'll head back to the entrance and hold off any reinforcements. That ought to help some. Yeah, I bet you will. You're probably gonna run away to a corner. It's like, I don't do that this time, maybe. Fear not. I shall escort him to the gate. I wasn't afraid. You go on ahead, Nahubino. Muster your forbidden power to its full extent and vanquish our sworn enemy. Risotto says, man, semi-cold water hits differently. Isn't it better for your body to drink, like... I know cold water is good for you, but isn't it good to have, like, room temperature water? Didn't I hear somebody say that to me once? I heard from someone that drinking room temperature water was, like, really good for you. I don't know if that's true or not. If it is, then, like, cool. But if it's not, then it's going to make me look like a loser. I should probably save. Because Lord knows I want to deal with that cutscene again. But yeah, unfortunately, Dazai's not coming with us. Risotto says, I don't know, but there are no bad effects to drinking water in general. I don't know, water, like, drinking too much water makes me nauseous. I don't know, I feel like it just goes straight to my stomach, even if I have, like, food in me. I just get, like, I don't know, I just feel bloated. Then again, I'm not all there as a human, so. Uh, Foil says, drinking too much water can be deadly. That's true. Useless. Darn it. I mean, water is good for you, and viewers, if it gets hot where you are, then please, if I end up turning the temperature for these videos, then by all means, you can so quench your thirst with some water. It'd be good for you. I was going to ask what everyone's preferred drink is. I'm more of a juice guy. Foil says you don't want to be... Stop it! He says you don't want to be kinky. No, I don't want to be that demon. I know you're trying to make a pun like set me up for another clip for you. No. I'm not falling for it this time. Ooh, a bee. Thanks. Hey, what's over here? There's an enemy like, looking in this direction. Risotto says drinking over 0.8 liters of water each hour can be deadly. If anyone can drink that much water, there's something wrong with you. Why? Why? And then somebody's just like, yo, man, I work out a lot. Gotta like, gotta like flush out my system after a good workout. Nah, man, don't do that. There are better other things you could drink. Other better things you can drink. Hey, come here. I can use new demons. Uh, foil says tea. <laughs> so so please piss out whatever be the case. That's true. If you drink the water, it would definitely like, be good to flush out your system. But there's such a thing as too much. Uh, but yeah, viewers, what's your favorite preferred drink? I'm more of a juice lemonade kind of guy. Well, more of the juice kind of thing, especially if it has strawberry in it. I could go for some strawberry lemonade. Luckily, I do have this iced tea over here that I have. I might as well just put that close. Risotto says I'm more of a coffee guy. I should really learn to make coffee. I want to do that. I want to be like Joker more from Persona 5. I want to learn to make some good coffee. The demon's approaching. What will you do? Stop them. Glare at them. Keep calm. I'm going to glare at you. We need eye contact. You know what that means? We got to throw down. What are you, a Pokemon trainer? Come on. Ow! Ow, that did a lot of damage. Holy moly. Maybe I should get rid of one of you guys first. Yeah, let me get rid of one of you first. Jesus. That was painful. Here you go, Luguru. Let's see. What would they be weak to? Well, I mean, I am an electric user, so... Hmm. Not what it's weak to, but it definitely does a lot of damage. Let's try ice. Ah, oh, weak to ice, eh? Which means they probably have fire. Ooh. I just realized... Ugh! Oh. Nah, nah, whatever. What's up? Dean has a guard up? I'll surrender! Sure, I guess. If you say, whatever. But you better make it worth my time. Why is your hair so long? It's just my style. Last haircut was a while ago. <laughs> a god must smite heretics. <sighs> Ooh. 
this guy is the world's biggest idiot or an actual god. Come on, man. You can't throw those jokes at me and not me choose them. He might be a god. I better join him. That worked? Nice! Oh, dude. Clipping pad, hang on. I'm clipping it myself. Because that was funny. See? Everyone kept mocking me because they were like, the puns won't get it. It works. 96 no's and a yes. But I still got a yes, so... <laughs> Alright, where do I go from here? More your lungers this way. I don't really want to fight these snake guys. Oh, wait, I don't actually have to. I can just talk to them. I would fight them more viewers, but they just don't give me, like, enough. They don't give me, like, enough, like, experience and stuff. Plus, talking to them gives me a chance to heal me, so, you know, that's what I could get. Excuse me! Can it fly over here? Uh huh. You can't jump, even though you can hover. Oh, is I'm over there. Oh, darn it! There's so much stuff in this area. Don't worry, viewers. This is not. Ah, who am I kidding? This isn't sponsored by Disney. This is blood. This is pretty much pure blood. Ah, uh, I want to learn how to make coffee. I like the smell of coffee, even though I don't drink coffee. To be fair, I. I think I tried coffee once, but that was a long time ago. I never really drank it. Uh-oh. Enemies. Uh-oh. Enemies. Uh oh Enemies. Uh, item. Wasn't worth it. But I do want to, like, learn how to make some better coffee. I think it'd be fun. Like, Persona love, uh, love aside, I think it'd be cool to, like, I don't know, some friends, like, go around there and be like... Uh, like, maybe some friends are like, oh, man, it's a rough morning. It's like, oh, I'll make some coffee for you. Uh, Foil says, do you drink adult beverages? Uh, no, I don't drink at all. I don't drink or smoke. Can't. I mean, I know I am of age now, but, like, actually, eh, is this an overshare? Eh, whatever. I'm also just put it out here. I can't say much on the drink aspect, but, uh, I had a issue when I was younger. I won't go too much into nitty gritty because I feel like it might be a bit of an overshare. Rizzo says, damn, Byman being the role model of health living, of healthy living? <laughs> no, I'm not. I'm, I got like a giant thing of iced tea and a bunch of Twizzlers, fruit filled Twizzlers here. No, my, my health is like terrible. I'm scrawny. Um, Rizzo says, how about wine? No, I, I, I can't drink. Uh, I get dizzy just from like the smell of the stuff. So I don't, I just don't. I'm, I'm good having other people, like, live that experience through me. Um, but the other thing I was going to say was... Well, one, I have a person... I have a friend that does do that, and I... No, nah, I'm, I'm, I'm good. They kind of, like, for lack of a better term, killed my desire to. So, even if it was, like, New Year's Eve, like, I just can't do that. It's just not me. But just the smell alone gets me. Uh, and there was a time when I was younger. Uh, I used to be babysat by Grandfather Vitamin. Believe me, he's got enough things on this, so let's not rattle his cage. He already got his ear pulled and everything. But there was a time when I was babysat by uh, my grandfather as well as my uncle. And they would, like, take me to, like, this, like... They had, like, uh, like gatherings where they and their friends would, like, get together, like, play, like, poker and card games and stuff. And, like, have, like, a ton of, like, like, uh, like smokes and drinks and stuff. And... I'm not going to front. There were times where I was, oh, sweet. Nice. Oh, money. Yes. Well, let's see how long that lasts. Uh, there were times where I got like very like lightheaded and dizzy. And apparently like there were moments where I had like, is the proper term fainting spells? Like when I was just like, kind of like, I was like out. I don't know the proper term for it. But it was the point where I was like around the scent of it so much that I just, it was just hard for me to breathe. And yeah, you can technically make the argument for like, well, yeah, but you were young. So of course, but no, like, it was one of those things that even years later, it still gets me. How do I... Do I jump from there? I guess I do. But it was just one of those things that was just like, I, I can't. So, no, unfortunately, you will not be catching me doing any of that. Apologize, viewers. I am not that kind of guy. Oh, well. Hello, Axis. Axis has also jumped on chat. But yeah, you won't catch me doing any smoking or drinking or any of that jazz. 
That's right, kids. Don't do drugs. It's bad for you. Don't smoke or drink. It's good to be healthy. Yeah. Risotto says, I never get why people become addicted to alcohol. Not only does it taste bad, it really screws you up later in the morning. Uh, I don't know. Some people might like the taste of it. I'd imagine some people used to it. Well, okay. I'm going to say this right now. If there's any viewers who use it for the sake of, like, to cope or to handle, I understand things might be rough, but please don't, like, don't turn to it for an escape. Like, we can talk. Oh, I have it that way. Please don't turn to it. Like, I'm not going to deny somebody they want to partake in the fine drinks and stuff. And I see a lot of, like, anime where the characters do it. But don't... Please don't fall to it as a crutch. I, I can't imagine what it's like, but I know some people do, and it's just not fun. And I have people that do, and it's not fun to, like... What? No, go away. Wait, do I have a florist? I don't know. I'm not going to, like, go into the nitty-gritty of why people do, because... Each is on like a different like experience. I might say one oh I have one, so never mind. I might say one thing and somebody be like, no, that's not the case, but please don't fall to as a crutch. But yeah, I just me personally, I just can't I can't deal with that stuff. And I'm good with it. I mean, I've built more of a tolerance to the point where I won't get lightheaded and stuff, but if I'm around somebody that like super does it, like if somebody like drinks a lot or smokes a lot and you can like smell from it, I won't be as opposed but i will if i'm prolonged to it get like some really gnarly headaches and i i i don't want to go through that because like i don't like pain i like inflicting on others <laughs> i'm sorry that was that's just not the time to make that bit but no i i just it's just not me although i do know another thing that like got me off of like the idea of smoking specifically um does anybody know the movie constantine excuse me um, so it was one of those things where, like, there's a moment in Constantine, if you know the scene, you know, but I only describe it as the black lung scene, and that should be enough to convince people. Uh, oh, hello, everybody. Jeez, there's a lot of you guys down there. Uh, Rizzo says, uh, smoke is absolute no, though. It's just paying for an addiction. At least alcohol has a sedative effect. Like, I, I don't know, it's, that scene in Constantine, like... It's enough that I already wasn't going to be doing it because of, like, some of the... There were other circumstances, too. But that was one of the things that was like, okay, I'm vitamins definitely not going to be going the whole smoking and drinking route. But do I want to fight these guys? They don't give them a screen. I'm just going to run. Screw these guys. They're not worth it. Uh, but, nah, you won't catch me doing it. Uh, but, yeah, the black lung seed. That's enough because, ugh, that scene was... Oof. That scene was a rough one. Keanu Reeves, man. I know you're like one of the best people of time, but come on. Get some help. Stop it. I'm kidding, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. I will say though, not to say I encourage it, but there's a show that Mama Vibe and I have been watching every now and then. Um, there's a show called uh, Drunk History, where like it talks about uh, like history. Well, there's three different versions that we saw so far. There's, uh, oh no, not this again. Oh, great. There's one that deals with, like, American history, one with British history, and one with Latino history. Um, we were watching some of those, and I will admit, I feel kind of bad for some of these people, because they get, like, really sloshed, but I gotta admit, having them retell, like, having them retell history lessons while being intoxicated, I'm not gonna lie, it's, it's pretty darn funny. I'm a little upset with Comedy Central, because it used to be on Comedy Central, uh, but I guess they got rid of it because bad moves or something i don't know why they got rid of it it's stupid but you can find it on um we have a paramount plus uh subscription so you can find it on there i'm pretty sure you can also find clips on youtube also on comedy central's website you can find out there too there you go paramount and comedy central there's some free sponsorship for you uh i'm going this way but uh i, I would recommend it. it's very funny entertaining seeing some of these people like rich fulcher and uh uh, Kyle Kinane and Mac, uh, Mark Gagliardi. Like, I don't know who these people are. Some of these are comedians, but it's really funny to do so. On the topic of tea, because I see chat going about tea, I want to try more teas. I've been trying to get into some different teas lately. The last one I had was, like, this, like, really nice, like, honey milk and apple cinnamon one. Two different ones. There was an apple cinnamon one and a honey milk one that were really pleasant. I really want to try some more teas. I don't know if I'm just more of a milk tea kind of guy or not. Which is one of the reasons why I want to go to Japan. I hear they have really nice, like... I want to go to the Botanical Tea Gardens. I think it would be super great to, like, go to them and just take in nature while having a nice sip of tea, so. 
Uh, Foil, I don't know if this is addressed to me or not, but Foil says you might like Thai iced tea. I don't know if that's addressed to me or specifically chat, but never heard of it. I wouldn't mind trying it, though. Which way am I going here? Am I going this way? I am going this way. Yeah, and I gotta deal with this nonsense not getting knocked off. Oh. Hmm. Hold on. I'm not falling for it. It won't get me from this distance, right? Okay. Foil says it's a Thai milk. Uh, the Thai iced tea is a milk tea. I also make it. It sounds delicious. No, oh, not these again. I hate these things. Right, whatever. Wait. What's the point of this platform over here? <sighs> now I'm curious. Oh, it's for an item. Yeah, well, come on this way. Gimme. Attack mirror? Eh. It's not money, but I'll take it, I guess. Except for the fact that I gotta go back over there. Oh wait, can I just Oh I can just jump. Okay, cool. Now uh, Foil says if you can make iced tea, you can make Thai iced tea. Well yeah, I can, but I never had a Thai iced tea before. Sounds good. Wait. Gotta be careful here. Not as overzealous. Is this supposed to go over? Whoa! Am I supposed to go this way? Oh, okay. I think I am. Okay. Am I supposed to go this way? Oh. Okay, I am doing it. Uh, Rosetta said, Lately people are going to crazy about this boba tea thing or something. Is it any good? I've never had boba tea. Oh, wait. No, no, no. Wait. Yeah, I have. Yeah, I have. Sorry, sorry. Yeah, I did have boba tea once. I had this, like... Strawberry milk boba tea before. Uh, it actually was really good. I'm trying to remember where the place was called that it was. It was really good. I should get it again. I could definitely kill for that, actually, right now. Um, I've had it. I guess it depends on, like, where you are in the world and who makes it. Like, I wouldn't go to, like... I would go to, like, a, a specialty place that does it. I wouldn't go to, like... If there's a place that's, like, exotic boba tea, like a really, like, nice name or a, simple, a simplistic name, I would trust that over than, like... Gary's boba teas are us or something like I wouldn't trust that and then it depends on like which one you want because some boba teas can be like they can be heavy on the boba some can be super sweet bobas are like the little like the little like tapioca balls right yeah so some of them can be like really good some of them can be like eh so I guess it depends on like where you go I'm supposed to jump down yeah I am but yeah I think it depends on your palate if you ask me personally um do I go to I don't want to go to the left one. I want to get that one to activate, right? Uh, I don't know if I'm where I'm supposed to go, so whatever. Uh, Foil says, some of the bobas are also filled with flavors. Yes, so some of the tapioca boba balls that you were like, I'm trying to watch my words here because I'm Foil. Oh! Whoops. Wait, is this where I'm supposed to go? I, I don't know if this is where I'm supposed to go. Risotto says, I'll try those, but I'm not fond of overly sugary drinks. I'm trying to cut out the sugar intake. Uh, oh, there you go. See? That uh, proves I'm not healthy, because I love sugary stuff. Um, you can get some of the stuff that's not, like, sugary or anything. But, uh, I think I went the wrong way. I'm supposed to go here. Okay. Oh, there's a... Packing thing? Hold on. I'm just looking at the puzzle here. Um... Not all of them are so overly sweet, uh, risotto. Some boba tea drinks can be, like... Actually, some boba drinks can actually be, like, very bitter as well. So, it kind of depends. You can, it, it really does depend on where you go. Because I know some places will prefer to it. The place I went to had, like, a bunch of options. Um, but I think it's completely a you choice. Uh, is this the right way to go? I'm kind of losing myself here. Wait. There's an eye over here, right? Am I supposed to go this way? I do want that item. But I think I'm supposed to go up here. Whatever. Uh-oh. Uh, hey. Sorry, I had a fight. I gotta get the other guys back off me. Oh, there's a lot of you. Uh... Ooh. 
The more the lower the HP of allies, the more damage and HP recovery can skills from you. Oh, whatever. Later. Don't worry, I'll send your friends after you soon. Why do I have Divine Arrowfall? It's basically like it looks cool, but it doesn't do as much damage as I thought it does. Or maybe I'm just not strong enough yet. Hmm. I want that move to be better. How cool it looks. It should do a lot more damage. Whatever. Oh, ooh, ooh, ooh. No, don't do that. Do this. Whoa. Ah, that's... That was strong. Mm, can I get it with Wrath Tempest? Give me some crits. Thank you. I'll take what I can get. And legend, thanks. This item better be worth it. A whittled goat? A whittled goat? Is that money? Is that soul? It's not a treasure. Uh, nope, it's not a treasure. A whittled goat, whittled goat. Oh, wait. I know where Wilco is. That's actually a really good thing, right? Yeah. When the Nahobino's HP reaches zero, the item is sacrificed to revive him at full HP. Oh! When the Nahobino's HP reaches zero, the item is sacrificed to revive him at full HP. Ooh. That's basically a free enduring soul skill. Nice. I will take that. That's going to be handy. Especially later. I also noticed it said one out of one, which means, unfortunately, you can only have one at a time, huh? Eh, that sucks. It'd be too good. I get it. But God, man. If you can get multiple little goats, I won't have to worry about getting insta-killed or anything. <sighs> Sometimes the world can be unfair. Just like the... What's the slogan from Malcolm in the Middle? Life is unfair. You didn't even attack the one that you were supposed to attack. Ugh, man. Yeah, viewers, that little goat is going to be, uh, that's going to be, uh, helpful. Let me tell you what. Now, unfortunately, Kinky has two turns. Ugh. Ow! Got a crit on Titania. Ow! I will not let you get the chance to use that. Can you hear me? I will not let you have that option. You know, hold my thought. Cause you're. Hmm. This won't be an awful lot now. Put that online. Yeah, you could. I guess, again, I would recommend trying boba tea, or at least like a milk tea, viewers. I think it'd be really good. It's delicious. But it really does depend on where you are in the area. Cause I don't know where some people are. Like, there's two like tea shops not near me near me but like i could order and get to but so i said who do a couple of plants in hot water would be addicting i mean in america it was one of the things that led to one of the most infamous moments of history the boston tea party but yeah tea's no joke tea's great so i said we have china thing for that yeah we do thank you china not just are you beautiful and artsy, but you gave us some fine teas. I need to heal myself. Okay, where am I supposed to go? So little goat will is worth it, but I do need to get back on track here. Okay. I think I did. Oh, I did. Yeah, okay, so there's a thing down here, right? Right? Where does the right path take me? Oh, not where I'm supposed to go. Oh, I'm actually back where I'm supposed to be. Cool. Okay, I see an eye over there. <laughs> Give me. Two concentrate gems? Oh, that would be handy. Uh, this one, I guess? Yeah. Wait. But 
there's a pathway over there, though. What is this leading to? Oh, I've, I've been over there. No, that's, that's the way I came from. Never mind, we're good. Yeah, this is the way I'm supposed to go. Sweet, cool. Alright, going further in the spectrums. Let me take this moment, viewers. Wait. The music got quiet. Wait, is this the... Is this the end? Oh. This might be the... Is this the, is this the bottom level? This might be the bottom level. Ooh. Hmm. Hold on, let me just map this area real quick. There's no enemies here? No, nothing? I know something's up because the music is gone. Let me guess. Oh, well, yeah. Big menacing door there. Oh, boy. What's this? Give me something good. Out of Akka's essence. It's not money, but whatever. Weak to ice. Completely block light and darkness. Well, that's handy. I prefer something financial, but... Nah. Yeah, I don't, I don't like this. The music got, like, very quiet. All I can hear is mostly my running. Yep. I think this is the bottom level. That's useless. Well, then... Let me save. But first... Viewers! Uh... I'm gonna be... Very, not Foil says, what can not be no stats look like? Garbage. My stats are terrible, man. Um, before I go further, chat, I'm going to have to do serious voice mode. So if you don't want to hear this, then sorry, but it has to be done. Because I was talking about it last episode, and I am determined to do it here thus far. So, bear with me. <clears throat> Viewers, it is I, Vitamin DGR. Call me V, call me Vi, call me Doc cool guy, sex master 909, whatever you want. Sorry, jokes aside. I have come to the realization that some people watching this playthrough might have a desire to play this for themselves. I will be doing this more or less regularly. I might even do it more earlier than when this video is, but I just want to say that we here, we don't try to spoil. So if any of you have any interest in playing this game, for yourself, right? Like, if you have any desire to, like, s play this for your own circumstance, I will not stop you from watching this, but I will like to say that I do not wish to spoil the experience for people. Whatever happens from here on forward will be, for lack of a better term, on your transgression. Like, viewer discretion is completely advised, because I know this is going to more sensitive areas, and it might deal with stuff that people may not be prepared for. Maybe you... And to be fair, it's could be said for any of the episodes, but we're pretty significantly good in this. We're like, what, part 25? 26? Part 26? So, yes. With all the kindness I can give, I am being as serious as I can. No more jokes. This is just me to you all. If you have any desire to play this game for yourself, and you do not want to be spoiled, I do not mind if you click off this video. I will not take it to heart. I'll understand it, because I do want people to have this experience. I do not mind. But if you do not mind and wish to be a part of this, you wish to see what this happens on yourself, or you have no desire to play it, but you want to watch this through, then keep on watching. I apologize if by some means that offends somebody. I just want to be level with you all. So thank you for this. Thank you for being a part of me with this journey. And hopefully I do not ruin this experience for you. Myself, my viewers, my chat, this community, I want us to have a great time, a moment we can just chill and relax, whether you decide to come in for a brief moment or stay through the long haul. I want us to be welcomed here and have a good time, okay? Thank you. All right. Ugh, had to get that done. I had to say it. It had to be done. Actually, now I think about it, because I, I know there's something bad. They wouldn't do... Look at this, the size of this door, right? They wouldn't do this without it being something important, right? Let me go save, just in case. Boyle says where your now no stats are. Terrible! My stats are garbage. I'm, I'm, I'm sucking with the luck. But then again, does luck even matter? 
I've never been lucky. Actually, since I'm here, before I do that, I should do a fuse for the episode. Do I have any demons I want to fuse? <laughs> Apparently I can make a new special fusion. Oh, if I make oh. Hydra, huh? Wait, really? Oh, yeah, yeah I could. If I spend t nearly $30,000. Ugh, that's so much money. Was also said, uh, this is the second MC and SMT series that primarily on strength base. Well, to be fair, you can choose whatever. I'm going for strength because I want to wail on people. Oh, yeah, I remember you. You were like the first boss I dealt with. Rizzo says the rest of the series really favor magic. Oh, that is truth. Especially if you saw what I was back in SMT4 Apocalypse. Well, actually, I was actually kind of balanced on that one. But no, that's that's true. Obviously, the first MC would be uh, the, the physical guy. What did you clip, Foil? Foil made a clip. I'm going to check on it after this episode, but I'm kind of nervous. He said, sorry, not sorry, and then put a clip there. And I'm a little nervous by that. I'll check it later. Uh, I don't... I mean, I have to make you at some point. But I don't want to spend 30000 for this. Eh, well, I'm not really using any of the demons. Uh, let's see. Medium dark attack to all foes. Chance of quickly poison. Cool. Sure. Whatever. Okay, let's give you... Oh, that's useless because you have that. Let's give you Dekaja. Inspiring leader. Axle claw. This. Here's your fuse for the episode, folks. It is too expensive, but... Oh well. Resort, I will say, the other MC that I know is primarily physical. Well, you were a part of it when I did Nocturne. Oh, I also like Nocturne. I think he's more my type than you. <laughs> Sophie was like, what? Ahem. Do I just... Stand as I play? No, I float as I play, huh? I was about to say, I hope I sit down more comfortable. The way I stand to do that kind of reminds me of, uh... Oh, hey, Hydra. Ugh. The way I stand like that kind of reminds me of... I know very few people are going to remember this movie, but... Uh... Does anybody remember Monsters vs. Aliens? There's the scene with Stephen Gobert's character, the president, who, like, he's trying to make communication with the aliens, and he plays that jazzy, like, thing on the piano. That's kind of what I, my vibe gives me when I do that. I just got somebody who be like, yo, why do you remember that movie? It's like, I don't know. It just popped my mind. There's no other demons I really care to make that are, like, cheap. <sighs> do I have to get rid of Skathag for it? I like Skathag, but... I did say I was going to go for the Demon Compendium, so I might as well start doing it. Uh, you're more of a magic guy, right? Yeah. Let's give you Megado. Even though you're going to learn Megadolo, so that's useless. Oh, well, there. Uh, yes, I am, Rosetto. Let's see. Makajamon, sure, whatever. Mudon, sure, whatever. Boon Boost. Eh, Marakuna, doesn't really matter. Skipping. Hello, Star. Uh, Decoravia star, not the actual person star. Alright, anybody else that I care to make? Heck a ton of cherries. If it doesn't cost money, I'll do it, but otherwise... Nope, cost money. I don't want to spend more money, so I'm not going to. What about with the demons I have here? Ah, <sighs> hate being low-leveled, man. Wait, I can do it with somebody? Oh. Yeah, not worth it. No, not worth it, like Sibley. Oh, Yummy Matsu. Oh, I got rid of Mermaid for it? I like Mermaid! Eh. Fine. Even though I really do like Mermaid, I did say I was... I'm trying to get into the mentality of, like, do it for the sake of Demon Compendium. That's, I said I was going to do it. 
And I really like Mermaid. I'll just have to get another one later. That's fine. Three weak physical attacks to a foe. Greater physical attack to a foe. Eh, okay. It's not like they're going to really have any crazy skills. Do that, I guess. Do that, I guess. Yeah, it doesn't really matter. Is this demon? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Skipping, uh, skipping animation. Okay, definitely turning down my headphone volume. Holy moly, that was loud. A fine scaler. A tough old crew like me picks these things up. Okay, that'll replace Rocket Conch. That's easy. You are literally just for the sake of adding to the compendium. And this uses a skill that I can't use because of this challenge I'm doing. So goodbye, Samaritan. You'd be helpful if I wasn't doing this challenge. Oh well. Yeah, I think that's everybody that I care about right now. Oh, <laughs> that's funny, the two of you make an element. Oh, I haven't made any elements, have I? I haven't really been doing that much. I ought to. Nah, I'm good right now. We've done enough. Uh, Alright, let's heal up and save and do this. She's like, you're going to probably die. It's like, yeah, I don't know what's on the other side of this, but I'm not going to like it. I already know I'm not. You don't throw no music at a giant door like that and expect it. Hello, star. Who jumped, the a real star this time, who said, let's go. A little worried by her saying that, but all right. Seriously, it got, it's getting even quieter. Star says, I'm going to try to stay up till you beat the... Oh, well, now I'm not looking forward to that. That means there is something on the button the other side of this. I'm going to hate this. Uh, Star said, what happened? You have another star? No, not you, but I have Decarabia star. Because I said, hello, star, and this star showed up. Uh, speaking of which, might as well just do some arrangements here. Yes, I am stalling because I'm nervous. Ah, eh, screw it. Let's just do this. It's bad, isn't it? Be careful. Yup. I knew it. I knew it. Because why else would Algami, this god to your voice, come out of nowhere being like, Be careful. There's a powerful demon ahead. <sighs> uh. Okay. What is it? Oh, it's Angel. Wait. Uh, Angel's not that pow- Oh. Now, what do we have here? Another angel here to spit on my castle? Mouth of foam with pieties? Uh, hello? I see a lot of bodies here. I've misjudged this low demon. Well, Angel got r- What the f- Ugh! You are just... You are just a haunting sight. What? You are just the most sexiest demon. I, might I say, you are just, you are curvy in all the right spots. Man, going on a date with you, I, I would imagine because of that tongue, you'd be a great kisser. Like, hear me out. Ugh. I don't. Ugh. I look kind of, like, majestic, don't I? I got a hand on my hip, sword on a hand. I'm like, oh, I'm ready for this. Why have I come? Oh, man. Good 
God's order will never die. Fine with me. Can I just like, is there a third choice where I'm just like, meh? God's order will never die. Or, eh. Hmm. What screams me? Because clearly that one's more law and this one's more chaos. God's order will never die. Fine by me. Kind of go with the ant, eh, personally. I mean, I'm all about, like, God's order not dying. Don't get me wrong, but... <laughs> I got chat being like... <laughs> I got YouTube. I got chat being like... One Risotto said, first choice makes you sound like a nerd. And then Star says, you're not that religious. I mean, like... Yeah, you're right. Eh. That's not why I said eh. I just said eh because I don't care. To be fair, the only thing I really like about you is I kind of like your sword. Like, jokes aside though, I think the sword looks cool. Ugh. Why does the tongue look so moist? Uh. Why does it look so, like, moist, though? Ew, and it flaps! Oh, wait, you go first. Screw you. Chad says they're meant to be moist for your pleasure. Oh, good you two. You guys are just disgusting. All right, let's do this. All right, bring it, bring it, bring it. I should know what Decorabios are weak to. I have one. Uh, light, huh? All right. I don't suppose I can, uh... We could talk this out. Nah, we're probably not. Alright. Fine, let's do this. But I don't know what Aryuk is. So you're supposed to be what? The Demon King? You're the one in charge of this castle? Fine. Bring it on, bruh. But I do want to see what you're weak to first. Here. Risotto said Decorabi is weak to ice in last games. Yeah. Unfortunately, Mega Ten can be really sporadic about its. Oh. For those that don't know, Mega Ten can be very sporadic about its elemental weaknesses. Believe me, I've made it a personal history to memorize many demons' weaknesses throughout the Shimigamis, the Personas, the Devil Survivors, the Devil Summoners, and unfortunately, it changes every effing iteration. Oh my god, it's so freaking annoying. Uh, ooh. Let's see here. Brave. Don't bother with ice. Okay, ice is gonna suck. It resists force and resists darkness. Ooh, you're weak to electricity, huh? Neat. It's good thing I have two good demons with it. Uh, Brave Blade. Heavy physical attack foe. High chance of crit. That sucks. Heavy physical one foe. Low accuracy, but it's guaranteed a crit. That sucks. Heavy ice. Haze Blast. And then my for dying. So you're an ice person, huh? Hmm. We to electricity's nice, because I have quite a few demons here, actually, that... Now that I think about it... Are any of us weak to ice? I'm not. Oh. Damn it. Lucaroo's weak to ice? Of course you are. Rizzo said, who do you think designed this demon and why? I, so, I think one of the people that, I don't know if it was this person, but there is an artist named Doi, D-O-I, or Doi-san, uh, who designed some of the art for this game specifically. Uh, Rizzo said, maybe based on religious depiction? Maybe. Like, I love the art style. Like, I make a lot of jokes about, but Armas though, sheesh? Oh, yeah. You're telling me. Oof. Whew. Sorry. Melts me away every time. She's never leading this team. Uh, but I think the person's Doi, or Doi-san, that also does the art for this as well. And uh, I just love the art in this game. Like, even despite how you look, uh, Ariok, even your design's actually legit cool. Gross, but cool. Alright, well, uh, let's do this. We shouldn't lose this fight, but you never know. Oh! Sucks that you're weak to electricity, though. Hmm. Don't bother with that. I need some more turns. Risotto said, best MT waifu, your opinion? Depends on the SMT game. Uh, it really does depend on the SMT game. Actually, Risotto, I thinks that Axis, this idea was being a thing, but 
I'm actually making a bit of a challenge for YouTube. But I know I stayed in a video, but I'm trying to see if I can get people to do it. If I get up to, I think I was going for 65 subscribers by the time this video is done. But if I get at least 65 subscribers, I'm planning on doing, at the end of this game, a Smasher Pass with every demon. Which is why I'm going to collect every demon. But I'm going to do an SMT, like, Smasher Pass thing. Um, I started to get a little nervous on how it's going to go. But I legit will do it if I get, like, 65 subscribers. So, there's a challenge, Twitch. Hop on my YouTube, subscribe, get this done. Uh, I don't know where I'm currently at right now, but I should double check and find it. I'm going to be laughing if I, by the time this video is done, like I premiere it and I'm already at like, I don't know, 70 subscribers. I'm going to be like, oh, huh. Didn't think I'd uh, get there that quickly. But like, there are definitely a few that are definitely some of my fave. Like, obviously I'll gush about Artemis and Mermaid. Pixie clearly, obviously best choice, Titania. And then, it's like some, I like Lugaru as well. I like Algami if I had to say it. Like, Zoto said, guess what? You have 66. Do I really have 66? I will go on my YouTube. No, I, I gotta focus on this fight right now. I read or not. Are you lying or are you being serial? I, have, I legit do not know. Do I have 66 subscribers? I, I can't, no, I gotta, I gotta focus on this fight first. I don't really have 66 subscribers on YouTube, do I? I'm making this a YouTube thing, Twitch. Like, Twitch, I would have done it. Risotto says, you have underestimated my alt accounts. No, don't do that. That's cheating. Don't cheat and use, like, alternative accounts just to subscribe, just to get me to do a, a SMT Smasher Pass. That's not right. Let's be, let's be true about this. No, I'm just kidding. Oh, okay. You got me, you got me, like, you got me. Starts to remind me of Sonic goes, oh, nice to make you laugh. I need to get rid of these Decoravios first. Rosetto said, but when I did sub, you already have 65. Wait, really? I really hope you're joking. I just got rid of that buff. All right, fine. You know what? No, no, I got to focus on this fight. I, I can't, I can't, I can't do nine things at once. By the way, I held back until on the 69th sub. I mean, you can. I mean, I'm assuming we still got plenty of episodes left in this video before this playthrough is done. Like, the cutoff is only going to be, like, before I beat this game. I'm certain that if people want me to, I'll do it. Star says, like, the scene with the Eggman. Oh! Star! I know what you're talking about! You're talking about the, the Sonic dubs! Oh, I love them! Snap Cube's dubs! I was actually going to talk about there during the Sonic playthrough. But yeah, I love it. Alfred, who plays Eggman. Oh, man, I freaking love them. It's like, I miss my wife, Tails. I miss her a lot. Which is a joke that I know very few people are going to, like, get. But, oh, my God. Viewers, if you haven't seen Snap Cube's dubs of Sonic, it's actually something I want to do, but unfortunately I don't really have... I'm trying to get some of my friends to do it for just some of the games. But just to give you a brief thing on it while I'm suffering this noise, uh, there is a... There is a... Uh, there's a group called Snap Cube. I guarantee if you go look up YouTube, uh, source says Abby, Abby. Oh hell yeah, dude! We're in, we're in this. We gotta make this happen. We gotta figure out what game we're gonna do it though. I was trying to talk about doing it for like Unleashed or something, but we'll or 06. Well, they already did 06. We'll probably do Unleashed or something. No, sorry, you're already like on board. But uh, for those that don't know, there is a Sonic dub where these group just does like this completely like unprecedented like right on the top of the moment improvised like dub of sonic games and it is the funniest thing like i'm seeing it yeah i'm a sonic fan so i'm probably gonna be biased but oh my god it's so funny i'm i'm like a hardcore like sonic fan i actually really should play that i should get into those soon um do i want to waste it on eh get some energy done but i think it'd be fun to do it for some sonic games so it says to be educated on the Chan lore. The Chan lore? It's a Chan lore. It depends. There are some Sonic lore things that are like... Oh, you're being funny. I know I know what you're referencing now. It took me a second, but... You, know, you be careful with some of the Sonic uh, things. Sometimes we go, oops! Go deep down the Sonic rabbit hole. It looks back. 
I gotta get rid of you guys. You gotta be careful. The Sonic fan base can be... Some I want to believe are welcoming, but some take it way too far. I'm saying this as a Sonic fan. Granted, I haven't been at the Abyss, but I've seen the Abyss. It's not funny. I feel like the Sonic fan base can be very inviting, but I feel like they could be similar to like how I view Fate fans, which is funny because I try to get into Fate, and there's some Fate fans that will like help me out, and there are many Fate fans that are like, what? You don't like Fate? What? what do you gotta do like this? And then it's just like, oh gosh. Star says I would say patched it. There's a, eh, that's a word. Okay, let's think here. I don't really... You know what? I'm gonna gamble you to physically attack me. I hope you don't use ice on Lugaru. That would suck. Wow, that was a good call. That's not a good call. Ah! Rizzo says T-Fortress 2 I think has the most welcoming community. It tracks every person. <laughs> yeah. Well, that theme though. Um... I'm going to switch Titania out for Sibylle, because Sibylle's Meteorama will be more helpful. Yeah, I know. Titania has Mahamon, but I need more healing than I need damage. Star says Sibylle is my fave SMT5 waifu. She's pretty. And she's crazy, which is a great combination. I'm going to have to get rid of Lugaru. You're not helpful, because I need electricity. Actually, I could probably switch you for that. Wait a minute. You have electricity, right? And you're like hot. Your turn. Go. Why did I just I can't believe I'm sleeping on Artemis? Um, I'm good with you right now. Whoa no 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 no. Tough. Just go away. Um. Hmm. I wasn't expecting it to, but it would have been nice. I can boost our attack, make us all hit a little harder. Probably useless. Well, none of us are weak to ice, so the only thing we really have to worry about would be physical damage. So, yeah. Actually, may not be that bad an idea. None of us are weak to ice. Wait. Is Sibley weak to ice? That was a great idea for me. Stop it! Don't get rid of that. I mean, don't buff that. Ugh, man, damn it. Wait, wait, wait. Hold on. I might have something to help with that. Purge Charm. Negate stat buff effects on foes. Nope. No boss for you. Uh, skip your turn. Give me some extra turns here. Mm, honestly, throwing the fizz block has been a really good idea, even if I haven't been intending to do that. I should really work on the other guys, too. I know, I should work on getting rid of the freaking Dekarabias. I am. Mm, boost our attack further. Yeah. Oh, I forgot to do Fizz Block. Oh, well. Oh, of course, the one time I don't Fizz Block. Sibley, hang in there. Never mind, Sibley's dead. <sighs> the one time I don't Fizz Block, too, and of course you get a crit. Oh, great! Oh, my little goat! Oh, that's fantastic! <sighs> I didn't intend for her to die. Of course, the one time I don't throw a fizz block, it gets a perfect crit. And all my demons did. I'm kind of lost this one. I'm gonna have to restart this fight. Ugh! There's no way, too. And I can't even bring... That's three demons and my little goat gone. All because of that nonsense. That's so fair. You wouldn't have to. Yeah, I'm gonna have to just accept the loss on this one. 
I mean, I'll still fight, but I'm gonna intentionally hope I die here. So I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna take this seriously. I'm just gonna skip the animations and hope you kill me. I know what I can do better for my next turnaround. Start with different teammates. Now that I know you're weak to electricity and light, I can prepare for that. Low accuracy, huh? Was always the BRB could get hot cocoa? Yeah, by all means. You get ready for this one, viewers. Ugh. I just can't believe the one time, too. And I get it, yeah. If the physical... Actually, hot cocoa does sound delicious right now. Of course, I know. It said uh, the hits are always guaranteed crit. I know that. But low accuracy should still be helpful. Alright. Um, I guess I'll stick with this team. For, well, Titania, you are useful. You do have the light and you have lightning, which is nice. Actually, starting with this team may not be that bad. Because you have lightning and light. Okay, you know what? Let's try something different this time. Well, one thing for certain is I don't have to waste my time using a spyglass, because I know what Ario's whole deal is. Be careful. I know. I knew this wasn't going to be easy. Skip. How do I skip? We don't need this again. Oh, thank you. you are quite fish. Shut up. Meh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's do this. Let go get a Twizzler. I need the sugar. I'm gonna work on the Decarabios this time instead of Ariok. Because I don't think he can do it again. I'm gonna to electricity though, so I can't get extra turns back. First, let's get four extra turns. If only I could just straight up get extra turns and do all that at the same time. Oh. Hmm. There's my light gems. One at a time. I'll still, I'll still keep doing, like, Runa's Thunder on Ario, but everyone else is going to start working on the Decarabias. So let's make y'all a little weaker. Um, hmm. What to do with you? I could keep wailing. Yeah. Just to get some damage in. I'm gonna throw some fizz blocks. Cause that nonsense is stupid. I'm gonna keep fizz blocks on every turn now. That might cleave us some horse. Whatever. I'm not gonna waste my turns getting rid of that right now. I'll deal with it later. I'll just hope I don't miss, I guess. Zoe says, oh, by the way, I've been hitting the gym for the past two months. Ugh! No, I'm, I'm just kidding. I'm kidding. Congrats. That takes dedication and commitment. I'm curious as to why, but I'm good for you. No, I'm, I'm totally joking about the whole thing. I, I make this whole thing about I'm allergic to gyms and all. Ugh! So it says the gym is quite fun to be H. I mean, I'd imagine, but it's just not my thing. I'll go with being a scrawny toothpick forever. Ooh, doo, doo, doo. Yeah, not this time. Not fall for that nonsense. Mm. Mm. It's time. I probably should have gotten in their buff, but meh. 
That's a decent mark. I'd rather get rid of one at a time. <sighs> You'd love to see it. I'm just gonna throw this at me just in case. And I was gonna. That was probably a bad idea. I knew it was buff, but I was like, well, surely I could still get a hit in, but. Forget me, I guess. I gotta get Ulukuru out of here. Yeah, not this time, chump. Ow! Well, good thing I'm planning on switching Lukuru out of here. <laughs> Alright, Sibley. Let's try this again. Then once Titania runs out of energy, I'll switch her for Artemis. Hail Rider, I'm gonna keep getting that Fizz Block on, because seriously. I feel like if I take off the Fizz Block for one second, I'm immediately gonna get comboed, or countered, or crit hit. Just believe it. Oh, wait, damn it! I didn't know your debuff was still going. I forgot about that. Crap. I'm gonna have to waste turns doing that. Risotto says, it's Fizz Block the same as Tetrakarn? So, Fizz Block in this game is what Tetrakarn is in older games, where... Tetrakarn, it's the same thing, where it reflects a physical attack, but Fizz Block in this case is, it doesn't ref Okay, actually, let me start over. Tetrakarn reflects a physical attack and damages the user, the attacker. Fizz Block nulls the physical damage and affects the entire team. So, it's a choice of whether you want to, like, do a counter automatically for a physical hit or protect the entire team and stop the damage completely. Unfortunately, Tetra Car only works on one while Fizz Block works on the whole group. Just to toss it at you real quick. Darn it. I should have prepared better. No, well, let's work on one. Never mind, I won't. Oh, heard of that. Get rid of that, though. Ugh. Still got robbed. Yeah. It's kind of lame. Rizzolo says, I remember Tetrakarn used to be the king of anti-fizz demons. Yeah. It was a dream. And they just... They stuck... They took it from me. Oh. Can I take this right energy here? Not good. Get this luck. Give me extra turn. Tanya doesn't have the energy. Hmm. Oh, come on! It wasn't even boosted! Seriously, Sibley, come on, man! You let me down really easily here. Oh, great. Omega Doe and, and Sibley's dead. Never mind. Great. HP, MP for itself. Mm. Guarantees to kill somebody. Raise all stats. Eh, screw it. We do need to work on your energy. Yes, I know. We'll get some extra turns first. I need energy for you for sure. Large MP. Yeah, I do need it. And I'm not having you die. Hmm, kind of thought they'd do a little bit more, but I don't know. Uh oh. Ooh, uh oh. I don't have the energy for a fizz block. Smart call here would be if you throw a fizz dampener. Please connect. Okay. 
I'll have simply throw a fizz damper. Ooh, 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 that was close. Fizz damper, fizz damper, fizz damper, fizz damper. Or. Nope. Let's be safer. I'll throw a Fizz Damper instead. I was going to throw a Tetracon on one person. I was like, nah, I don't want to tell you because I don't know who we attack. Rather be safe and go for everyone. Oh, great. Use that noise, huh? Does it have my Bufu Dime? I think it does. I gotta be smart here. I don't know what its AoE moves is. I know it has Megadola. Should be a pain to deal with that. Come on, me. Come on, me. What would it do for sure? I'm. It's. I know Dekarabi would make a Dola, but what would Ario do? He would either physically hit us or use an ice move. What sucks is messed up as it is, and I've got to apologize to Star my mentality on this, but I'm not really worried about the ice move because I know myself and Pale Rider can block it. Titania has Endure. I'm a little scared of Sibylle here. But I'd rather block a physical attack because I know it has Hades Blast. So I'm instead going to give the energy to Pale Rider to do a Fizz block. Rather do that instead. I was gonna do an ice thing, but I'm not too worried about ice as much. I can only hope that I'm not dooming or condemning Sibylle. Or I can switch her out. No. Be smarter. Fully heal you just in case I get hit? Or guard and hope I can take the damage. I'm gonna guard. And hope for the best here. Use the physical attack. Use Hades Blast. That's not Hades Blast. Ugh. Ow. Ow. Well, that could have gotten better, but that was actually a really good call. That sucked. But at least you're looking weak. That really did suck. Holy moly. We got lucky. That could have really been bad for me. God, I hate being weak to fire. Ah, just die, Dekarabia. What do you want from me? Well, I know what you want. You want to kill me, but still. I'm not losing my little goat again. Hmm. As I ran out of energy. Any more turns. My buffs are gonna end after this too. Ugh. Mm. Uh oh. Oh! Oh, I forgot. Wait. Wait. I didn't lose an extra turn? Does she have that safeguard thing? <gasps> she does have safeguard. Oh, that skill's so good. Viewers. Please, always have safeguard. It's such a good skill. I'm gonna give more energy to Pale Rider. So I can do another Fizz block. Thank God for safeguard. I, I saw that miss and I felt like my heart just... Rizzo said your life flash, almost flashed in your eyes? Dude, I saw myself in my crib back in New Jersey. I was about to cry. This game does it, man. And I'm glad, because that would have sucked for Sibley. That was very clutch. Holy moly moly. Hmm. I probably should have. Oh, well. Might as well do this. To be low. Hmm. Not yet. Not yet. What would be the smarter call here? Think, V. Think. If I do Ruinous Thunder to get an extra turn, the problem is I just don't have the energy. 
know what's good with us? I don't know what I'm gonna do. Just die. Yeah, what the heck am I doing? I forgot I had that. Got him. Also, I didn't have to worry about Deck Rabia. Oh, it would have made it easier. Wow, I did it! Granted, the second time around, but yes! Why the frick did I forget I had that move? No, seriously, why did I forget I had Free Kugel EX? That would have solved my issue. Well, I mean, I don't know that would have killed it last turn, but that would have been way easier if I remembered. Whatever, I did it. Oh, that's funny, you know, Lullaby? Makes me think of Midsummer Night. Uh, chains of Afflicting Sleep to all foes. I kind of like your skills. As they are. I mean, I don't even know which one I would want to get rid of. I mean, Mahamal's been useful, but I do have better light demons. I'm going to give Titania a rest after this, so yeah, I'll do it. Trebian, I shall hunt with this skill and feast like a king. <sighs> I'm so glad I did it. Next strength based attack of self will be 100% accurate and a guaranteed crit. Uh. Yeah, this. Oh, that's it? Oh, okay. Phew! We did it! Screw you, Arioke! Hey, I take offense to that. I didn't pay attention to what you said. Whatever. See ya. And so the demon king has fallen. Let us report to battle at the castle's entrance. You could at least say my name once, Algami. Oh, and now I can make you. Hmm. I wonder if I actually can make him. I guess I will. Oh, no. Oh, I gotta fight you now, too? Come on, man. I didn't get to heal. One less ugly sore to deal with. I don't want to deal with you. Where's your hot partner? Put the demon king out of the way. Humanity's future just got a little bit brighter. Soon enough, we'll be on even footing with the demons. Even footing in what sense? How is our future any brighter? Hmm, what seems more dramatic? Even footing in what sense? How is our future any brighter? I'm trying to like say it in different means and see which ones would be better. Eh, I'll go with that. How is our future any brighter? Think about it. Your friends are human, yet they fight against demons, even pitting other demons against them. If this doesn't spell a brighter future, I don't know what will. Oh, okay. If I may interject, only a select few can fend off demons. Those who can't, and that is a great many, will die. How does this profit humanity? Man, I forgot how I looked as a human. Speak only when you're addressed, Bethel Construct. Don't you dare talk to Algami like that! I'll kick your ass again! i do it! Nobody, and I mean nobody, talks to my Algami like that. As one created to protect humanity, particularly the vulnerable, I cannot condone your attitude. <laughs> so says the slave to his programming. Listen. Without the will to fight, the will to live is meaningless. If someone can't fend for themselves, they're better off dead anyway. Wow, you really are just an asshole, huh? I get it, but you're still an asshole. Giving into temptation, betraying one's fellow man. Anyone like that should have never been born. Hmm. You're too harsh on people. I understand what you're saying, but you can handle that a lot better. Like... That's the... Surely... Mm, well, this is going to out my personality here, but whatever. Yeah, I get it. There are some people that 
need help, and honestly, they should be able to fend for themselves, but that's kind of the point of being of service and helping people, so... He and I are in accord. I presumed you were acting on behalf of all humanity. Perhaps I was mistaken. I need not answer the likes of you. Ah, oh. Yakimo. So this is where you were. Can I rather talk to her than you? Did something happen that I might wish to know? He's like, no. You don't need to know about my secret plans to secretly eradicate every single demon and only allow humans to rule. She's like, does that include me? He's just like, not a word to the girl. I don't care how attractive she is. Do not fall for it. Uh, it's kind of hard to, I mean, have you seen her? You have no idea how lucky you are. God, if I were you! Ugh! All right, we're good. Nothing important. Let's move. Also, I want your katana. I want your katana. I want Nua. You get everything, man. Some people get all the luck. It's so unfair. Life is so unfair. Why does he get all the luck, man? But jokes aside, though, I get his understanding, but you can't just be like, if the people are weak, then it's on that. Like, we can't be doing this. There's some people that need help. You can't just leave them to their devices. There's no guarantee he'll get strong enough. That's putting a lot of assumption there, buddy. Also, yeah, I'm here. I sense a change in the world. A great demonic power snuffed out. You could have helped. She's just like, someone, my, uh, no, actually, she'd be more likely to say, my lord has told me to keep watch over this to make certain no trespassers intervene. Yeah, but I feel like your lord would also say to help your fellow man. Like, you should have helped me deal with our yoke down there. She's like, that's not what my lord said. It can be none other than our yoke. Which means you have brought that fallen angel to justice. And just to say, chat, I have been looking at you guys as I've been reading this. I haven't been ignoring you guys. Because Risotto said he had the same view as Chaki. Yeah. Yeah. That's a good way to put it. And then Star, I noticed that you've been getting comfortable. Hopefully you are nice and comfy. Nice going. That's the guy I know. That's not what it says. That says that's the not that's the not Hakami I know. Indeed, you have done well. The sacred order of this world is safe once more. So Tokyo's safe now. We did it. Right, Master Abdiel? Not merely Tokyo. But the mortal world. Yet know this, mortal. To live as Nahodino is to live condemned. By virtue of their being, they threaten the natural holy order. Oh, I don't like the fact that the music just got deeper when you said that. That doesn't sound good. The word of God is the only true path to save this world. Your very existence profanes your triumph. One day... I will have to decide whether the sin of your being must be judged. Yet for Aww. now, at least, you have done us a great service. Return to Tokyo, and take the rest you have well earned. Hark! For the Demon King has been slain! Let all Bethel ring with our victory, glory, and rejoice! Hallelujah! I feel like you're kind of taking... The victory from me here, but guess we'd better head back too. Did anyone else get that from Abdio? Or is it just me? She was like, You have done a good service, but your very existence as a Nahobino is nothing but a threat, a blight on this world. It cannot exist. That's essentially saying because I'm exist, because I exist, that I'm already causing problems. There can be only one true God. I'm not saying I have to be God, but, like, surely I can be allowed to exist. Wow, you really did take the victory from me there on that one. I don't care how hot you are. That's, like, messed up. You're finally here once you beat the Demon King on Long Battle from the end. I already beat the Demon King. You're so late. There's always one guy that's just, like, late to the party. <laughs> Actually, it's funny. I'd imagine, like, all the angels, like, got full, like, aware of this. And this one angel specifically, he was, like, late because, I don't know, he, like... Went to the bathroom, he has like toilet paper hanging from his foot. He's like, oh, I'm here. I am ready to go fight the Demon King. And then it's like, 
Frank, I swear, we already handled it. The blue boy just took care of it. <sighs> just go home. He's like, sorry, I had the, the special seafood platter at uh, Sizzler's. Well, no, I'm good. Well, we did it. That's, uh, unless there's anything popped up, that's the third area complete, actually. Yeah. And I still have some time in this video. Which means this video might be shorter, but there is something I kind of want to try. I don't trust I'll be able to do it. I want to compare myself and see if I can. And I know some viewers are going to be wondering what I'm talking about. I guess I'll give it a shot. If I die, then it's whatever. Like I said, the video's probably going to be shorter anyway, but... On a quick note, we did it! We beat the third area! I... <laughs> wow, we did it! Sweet! Ah, oh, this area was just a nightmare. There's a lot of treasures to get. I'll probably have to do that all off camera. But there is a couple things I want to do first. Before I call this a good session. Welcome. First off, how do I make Arioke? Well, I guess I won't be making you anytime soon. Holy moly. 75! Oh, God. Well, I guess I won't be doing that anytime soon. And I still didn't level up, which means I still am not going to make freaking Ishtar anytime soon. God! Urgh! Or I guess, technically I am a god, so... Me! Urgh! I'm going to have to make some demons. Yeah, I'm going to eventually do it. Um, Return. There's something I want to do real quick. I want to compare myself again with this. And if I can't, then I'll just probably end the video afterwards. But if I can, it'd be good to end it on a good note. Well, actually, I've already successfully done it, so viewers... I'm gonna think on the next ep what is that over there? On the next episode, I'm uh because I know they said to go back to Tokyo. I'm assuming that's some serious story stuff going there, so I will probably next episode address it. But this episode, there's one thing I wanna do. If I can. There's a couple things I wanna do, actually. I wanna compare myself. See, I wanna get a gauge. Uh, because I'm not expecting me to win this. I'm just trying to get a gauge of, like, am I strong enough? Am I closer? Do I still need to put more work? That kind of jam. And I know some viewers are like, what are you talking about? You'll you'll see really soon. So I am going to save as soon as I land back here in the beginning area. I want to see if I can, uh... Hold on. Let me, uh... Sorry, just doing some arrangements here. I'm doing some uh, quick preparations. Because I want to be certain. I'm not the gun and team that this will work. That would be nice. Uh, nope. Does anyone have. Because I remember when I tried it and I immediately died. I don't think I'm going to be able to pull it off. Okay, whatever. Okay, let me... Oh, wait! Holy crap, I have 145 glory? Wait a minute. The heck have I been saving this for? Why have you not been spending your glory, boy? I forgot! I just haven't been paying attention. Um, what can I get? Demand essence for corner demons. Eh. If a demon's mood sours min negotiation, they may forgive you. Nah, I kind of... Whoa, no, no, no. I kind of like it when it doesn't. It's kind of funny. I think I'll just save it, really. I don't really have a need for anything. Right. Yeah, I'll just save it. There's nothing really crazy I want to go for. I'll probably go for all of them eventually. I'll go off camera at some point in time and, like, I don't know, like, find blue Matama. I know where some of them spawn in the beginning areas. If they keep giving me glory crystals, which I'm pretty sure I have a good number of them now, they'll probably give me enough, like, glory to handle it. All right. Let's see... Or, well, let's test. Hello, Star. Gave me a hello. Right, it's test time. Ooh, chill out there. Uh, what are those things called again? The little spiral dra uh, demons? What are these things called again? The fire ones? Yeah, whatever, it doesn't matter. Star says, now I'm in comfy bed. <laughs> Alright. I want to gauge... 
two things. First, I want to see if I'm stronger now that I can actually do some work against you. If not, I'm prepared to die. Are you back for more, boy? Yep. I saved. I did save, right? I did save. I remember from last time I tested you, when I first unlocked you, and I got creamed. I know you're still weak to darkness. I'm pretty sure you're still weak to darkness. Oh, God. Nope. I'm still not strong enough. Damn it. Star says, did you save? Are you sure? Yeah, I'm pretty confident. Well, I know it's weak to darkness, but I am not strong enough to take this dude down yet. Damn. It. Well... Oh god. Yeah, I'm not strong enough for this. This was a mistake. Wow, that was even with that too. Yeah. My setup, not strong enough for this. Well, whatever. I did save, so it's all good. Like I said, I wasn't expecting to pull this off. It was more like just a test to see, a gauge my strength. I am definitely better than what happened last time. I know that much for sure. Severe on my attack based on level 12 folks. Oh, that's getting neat. Like, I'm already confident that I'm stronger than before, but... Oof. This is a... Uh... Why'd I do that? He doesn't have physical moves. He has, like, AoE spells. We're dead, aren't we? Oh! Well, <laughs> he's had my goat. Yeah, not strong enough for this. Call allies? Ah, oh, flip... Well, I also know this too. Star says this for funsies. Yeah, it really is. I'm not expecting to pull this off. Also, wait, you summoned Byako slash Baihu? That probably means... Oh, no. What if it means, like, as I'm weakening you, you're going to summon all four of the other... Or all the three of the other mooks? He's like, are you seriously... You seriously wanted this? Alright. Don't toy with me. Just kill me. They're toying with me. Well, fine. I'm just going to keep using Profane Land as million times as I can. Oh, or I guess when I miss. You do summon your friends! Oh, no! You summon all the, the Mythos? You summon the whole squad? North, South, East, and West? Oh, that super sucks. Oh, and you cure your element. Oh, that's fantastic. Stop it! Just use fire and kill me! He's toying with his food. But... That is good to know. Okay, so I am right. Which means, as the turns go, he's going to summon... Yeah, he summons Zwan Wu, or Shan Wu, he summoned Baihu. Which means he's probably going to summon, um... What's the other one? Not Suzaku. Uh, King Long. I was about to say Seryu. Uh, King Long, and you're probably going to summon... Yeah, Suzaku, actually. Yeah, the bird. Right, well, that's good to know. I'll keep this in mind for next time. Stop it! Just kill me with normal moves! Don't use electricity or ice! I'm telling you right now! There we go! Ah, oh, the sweet relief. Alright, well, I died to that. Which means I'm probably not gonna be cl remotely close to pulling that off anytime soon. Probably a bunch more episodes. Alright, well that's test number one. Now to do test number two. There's one other test I want to do for this video. And then I'll call it. I just want to make certain on something. It's always good to get get a gauge. Star says, what's the plans now? There's one other person. More than Huang Long, who I want to fight, I'll be very honest. I really hope I'm able to beat her. Because, remember from what I said many episodes ago, she's probably one of my favorite. I really want to have her to the team. I want her to be a mainstay. But if I cannot beat her now, then she is my truest goal. Say what you will, but she's the wife. She's one of the waifus I need to have. Like, I cannot be whole without her. So, let's try this again. It's funny, too, because some of the people in this chat right now, like, access of them, I know aren't here, and they'd be drooling. And I know some viewers are like, what is this? But for those that know... <sighs> okay, hold on. I'm just... Okay, just adjust my tie. Slip my hair back. My suit's really nice. How's my breath? <laughs> 
Alright, we're good. Hey, Alvarez! Wow, you joined it at a very interesting time. Alright. Yes. If I can't pull this off, then it's fine. I'm okay with dying here. But, I do need to at least test to see if I'm closer. And I know some viewers on YouTube are like, Who? Who is it talking about? Star says, let's go. I got tissues and lotion. Yeah. Who's there? What is it? <laughs> I can't take pictures fast enough. I can't. I can't take pictures fast enough. Ah! No, I need it with this. Hold on. I can't. I'm, I'm trying to mash as fast as I can the stupid capture button. I'm not trying to record videos. I'm not recording. Let me take more pictures. Ugh! All right, we're done. Who are you? Wait, I've heard rumors of you. You're from Bethel, Japan. Oh, I did press R. Don't worry. Don't worry. I know. After everything I've done and so I don't care. Just... I just want to see. I'm going to create cream from you. Where is she looking at? It doesn't matter. I want her eyes on me. I don't... 61. Oh! I don't... We're still not going to pull it off. But that's not too far from the mark. Star said the noise, Vichy. I'm sorry. I'm very sorry. Actually, you know what? No. It's for Cleo. It's worth it. I will say this. Um, she's actually not far stronger. I love that she keeps doing that as her animation. Hold on. She keeps doing that as her animation. I will say this. Uh, she's level 61. I'm like... And viewers know, whenever I test like my strength for these kinds of things, I go by the weakest demon on my current team. So I'm not going by me specifically... Because I know I can probably handle more or less most of the demons around like 57 or whatever level I am. But my weakest demon on this current team will be Hydra. Even if I swap Hydra out for like someone else, I'm still within like the 56 to 58 range, right? Which means I'm not strong enough yet to take down Cleo, which means I'm probably going to die here. But I'm actually not that far off, which means probably odds are... Maybe by, like, I don't know, a couple more episodes, a couple leveling up, we'll handle this. Axis says we're still up. Wow, you came in at a weird time. Chat, can we, like, throw some shade on... No, I, no I'm just kidding, I'm just kidding. Uh, press the plus button while checking stats on Cleo. Oh, yeah, I know. Don't worry, I got y'all. I know. I remember it's the display thing. <sighs> Now, if we're talking about some of our fave demons, Cleo is definitely one of them. And not just obviously for the obvious reasons, but stat-wise, Cleo's one of the best demons in this game, too. Like, I remember how good she was back in Apocalypse. I know she's crazy in this, too. Believe me. And I know some viewers are like, what do you mean? Trust me, I'm not going to get her now. But when I do, you're welcome. Axis, you missed a picture session. Uh, anyway, yeah, I'm probably going to die here, but... Like I said, level 61 isn't too far off. Resist fire, resist ice, resist lightning, resist force, absorbs light. Gotta use darkness. Risotto says, sorry V, my heart still lies to Pixie. But with a game like this, come on, you have people like Cleo and Nua and Abdio. Although to be fair, Pixie is still like, she's still all time waifu, but this game gives you unique chance of, oh God. Inflicting charm to all foes and lowers attack defense by two ranks. Mazandine, Mabufudine, Hamabarian, which is the second strongest light move of normal damage. Hysterical Slap, which does greater effect if it's charmed. And Mabufubarian, which is one of, if not the strongest ice moves in the game? Oh, man. I can't wait to go to you for a, this thing. Yeah, anyway, I'm gonna try, but I'm not expecting to survive this. Yeah, I barely did that much damage. I'll breathe on you. Don't take that context. I am doing damage, so it is nice. I am doing damage. Yeah, like I said, I bet in like... I don't know, what? If I level up every episode, four or five episodes, maybe I'd stand a chance?
Mm, two turns, huh? Ow! Wait, one whip did 116? Jesus. Any of us weak to ice? Yup. Two of us weak to ice, in fact. I expected it. It's completely fine. Wait, no! Damn it! She has the Hama Baryon. Loki's weak to light. Well, that was a useless turn. Hold on. I meant to do Artemis. That was a waste of a turn. Hmm, nah. Well, like I said, I'm expected to die, but I'm giving my best. I know what better use now, so when I get some... I don't really have many, but once I get some dark base demons, that'll be very handy. Wow, I resisted, and it still killed him. That's crazy. That's ridiculous. God, she's so good. She's perfect. And a pain. God, why do you do so much damage? You don't have to do that much. Ugh, and I can't use it because of the stupid challenge. Ugh! Sometimes this challenge really sucks, Star. And other chat members that are responsible. I'm not trying to single out Star specifically. But she was one of the few people that, like, was on it, so... <sighs> Whatever. I'm a gambler. Hurry up and kill me. I'm not expecting to survive this. Hang in there, Artemis! Okay, see? We're good. Alright, we gotta be smart. We gotta be smart. Yeah. Another reason I know I'm not perfectly equipped for this, because at this point I would have done a lot more damage, and I'm definitely not now. Um, We do need more teammates. Nija... What happened to Sibley? She froze! She's dead! Are you kidding me? Look at her. There's no way she'd survive. But again, it's not like I'm actively trying to get her killed. I want that to be said. I'm not trying to kill these demons on purpose. Financially speaking. It just ends up happening like that because I'm getting wrecked. Ow. That hurt. No good. Oh, great. Oh, of course it was a crit. Ugh. God, just chill out for a second, okay? I need to summon one more teammate. <sighs> I should summon a dune for the stat boosts. <sighs> you know what? If I'm going for this. Let's go. Help me. I'm dying. It hurts. <laughs> Give me a crit for some extra turns, please. Thank you. Um, um, um. Your defense is already lowered, huh? Oh, it's not. Uh. If I use Dia Haran. No, because that's the purpose of why I had a. What's her face? I'll just keep your defense lower. Oh, Axis said. Despite me never letting go of Baja Blast Death in this playthrough, I hope you win. B, you got this. Axis, you're a little late to this. I'm expecting to die. I am not trying to win. I mean, I am trying. Because I'm not going to just roll over and die. But I am not expecting to win this fight at all. I'm still underpowered. I appreciate the support, my friend. But not this episode. <laughs> maybe in the future. Like I said, like, I don't know, maybe five, six more episodes, maybe? If I at least level up. Guarantee one thing, if I was strong enough to make the Ishtar I wanted, I'd be definitely strong enough. But no. Can I confuse you? Nope. I'll do your worst. Ow! Actually, that's not that bad. Uh oh. Ooh. Let's see, what would you do? 
He'd probably do this. Because that would suck. Do Mazandine. I'm not worried about... Actually, I'm not really... <clears throat> Mabufudine? Maybe? Oh, I don't know. I bet you do this frolic thing. Chance of Trying to Ruffles. I know you would. Because it would lower all my stat boosts. Well then... If you're going to go all out... Let's go, ladies. It's funny how my better team... These are some of my better teammates. I gotta get better. I gotta get stronger. That's kind of doing work. Ooh, man. Just love hearing that sound, don't you? Yeah, but you resist. Eh, but it's still a crit. Um, just in case you get hammered, should I, like, bull Hygia prepare? Yeah, probably a good idea. Just in case. Here we go. Yeah, see, we're getting to about half health. Not bad. Seriously, Artemis is so good. We're about half health. That's pretty good. Even though we lost a good number of our better demons. I'm gonna guard. Because the dude might be carrying me. Alright, bring it. Do your worst. I can take it. Hopefully. Uh, enter! But god, I guarded! And it still almost killed! Oh my god! I guarded, and I still almost got creamed. If it wasn't for Endure, I would've been hammered. Holy crap. That's stupid. Um, oh, the defense is about to lower. Not that I have anything about it. But that also means Titania and Adun can't take another hit. I'm glad I did this, but now I need energy. Keep our buffs going. Our buffs are going to carry us. You do have a good setup. You do have a good setup. I just gotta be smart. Just gotta be smart. Just starts at six more episodes. I mean, I'm surprised I'm doing this well. <sighs> Damn it. No crits. The whole time. Alright, I do need to give Idun energy. You're worth giving a chocolate pot for sure. I need more Makatsuhi. Ugh, sucks. Whoa. We have just received word that young Vitamin has passed out because he was too excited. We apologize for anybody that was expecting something. Uh, I am his spokesperson as well as his doctor. I am currently testing his heart rate, and unfortunately, he has passed out. Me, can you say anything? <laughs> and it is apparent that he is still saying a lot of gibberish. I apologize, viewers. Give me one minute. Uh, we just have to... Vitamin? It's okay, Vitamin. Please. Vitamin. Come on. You have the episode to run. I understand that she's attractive, but come on. We have a number of people that are watching this. Please, now's the time. Would you like water? Would you like perhaps a fan? <sighs> Here's some water. There you go. Drink. No, no. Drink slowly. Drink slowly. There you go. Okay, okay. Your nose is bleeding. Here, I have a tissue. <sighs> thank you, thank you. Mm -hmm. All right, you're good. It's okay, it's okay. Take as long as you need. You'll be fine. The frolic! Yes, I know. It is a good skill. It is an amazing skill. And as the CEO of the Connoisseurs of the Culture, you have to be better for this. You can't pass out at the first sight of something like that. Otherwise, you're going to have to step down from being CEO. You have to do this. Now, are you feeling better? Uh, sort of. You have ten more seconds. By the time ten seconds are done, you'll be good, okay? One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 
Now, how do you feel? But, sir, better. Uh, thank you, Doc. Of course, that's my job. Uh, Doc, how did you get into my room? All the day's work. I'll see myself out. Thank you, Doctor. Um, I don't know how he came into a room. I'm good. Don't worry, chat. I'm better. I'm, uh, oh, sorry. Wasn't expecting Frolic to be, uh, it's also funny that it worked on Adun of all people, too. She's like, I mean, can we, do you look at her? Of course. I don't blame you, Adun. I'm surprised I didn't get charmed by that. What, is she just not my type? Like, she better be. I should probably cure that, huh? Ugh. Help for assist. I need to spam Frolic. Dude, if I get her, she's always using Frolic. And viewers, in case there's any younger audiences watching this, which I doubt it, because this is this kind of game. Uh, if you want to know what that was, don't get it from me. Please don't get me in trouble. Uh, let's see. Okay. That aside, I need to focus. Okay, come on. Gotta get ahead of the game here. Uh, let's see. I gotta get rid of Un's charm. I need Artemis to have energy. So... Look at that. Honestly, a chocolate drop would be better. I don't really want to use too much. I want my Makatsuhi up. If I have my Makatsuhi up, then I can guard again. If I can guard, yeah, if I guard, I'll have the energy. I can go all out next turn. No, I can't! I don't have enough! Ow! Alright, we're good. We have to go all out. We have to. Hmm. Actually, better thought. We don't go all out now. Because I could use Idun's thing to boost our stats. Next turn we go all out. That would be a better idea. I have to use this turn to just keep you weak. Maybe boost us a bit. Yeah, that would be a smarter idea. So let's use... Boost our attack. You to... Oops. You to... Keep your defense lower. You to heal. <laughs> Get a little more damage in. I hope she does a frolic, though. Now that now I'm realizing, frolic kind of sucks. It gets rid of, like, a lot of the work I'm doing here. Um, I'm not expecting a crit. I should guard. Her better skills are light and ice, so I'm not really too... Actually, I'm not really too worried about using her skills. Her better skills are light and ice. If that kills me... Okay, I was about to say, if that killed me, I would have cried. Because now I'm putting all this work in to try to win... Oh, you're doing it too, huh? Well, don't worry, I'm doing the same. What if my chat's okay? They've been I've I've been looking at the chat messages. I think they were worried about my well-being. Thank God. Don't worry, my doctor is here. Or uh, well, tended to me, so we're good. Hopefully. Although he might tend to me in another reason, cuz now I'm realizing another thing. If I win this, how much money do I have to spend to get back Sibley, Pale Rider and Hydra? Which means this is a double-edged sword, because, yeah, I get, like, one of the best demons and definitely a waifu. But at what cost? Financially speaking, it's gonna suck. Alright, you know what? We gotta do this now. We've gone too far. She's looking weak. Have a warning. We now have to go for it. We have to. I owe this service. Um, ooh, not that. Actually, I'm gonna just have you guard, just in case. Uh, she's looking almost, almost, almost there. Ah! 
Oh, not enough! The Empress says this was only a test, never happened. Oh, dang it! I'm so close! Keep guarding. Oh, I probably should have healed myself. Eh, well. I'm not worried about that. Oh, wait, but that might kill two of us. Well, Titania's dead. That sucks. That's it, more money I gotta spend. Great. You don't have darkness, do you? No, you don't. Does anybody have darkness? That's, like, good. No. Huh. That would've been handy to keep that in mind if I remembered that. Oh, well. I don't really have... Wait. Ah, damn it! Super damn it. I completely forgot about Decarabia. Wait a minute. I'm also realizing something else here. How much energy does it cost for... <sighs> Ooh. I gotta throw a... I gotta throw a thing. I gotta throw a chakra drop. Just one. That was close. I was gonna throw it away. Please don't miss. Oh my god. I just realized how bad that would have been if Dekarabia missed. I would have cried. <laughs> I don't have the energy to do this again, so... Please be enough. At least I'll give you extra turn, but please be enough. No! It's not enough! Just please, just go! Just die already! Well, not really die, but like... Please be beaten. Damn it, it wasn't enough. Oh no. Well, Dekarabia's dead. Oh, that's so much money. All right, well, here's the good thing. I know I won, but how much is it going to cost to get Sibley, Titania, Pale Rider, Dekarabia, and Hydra back? And my viewers are probably just like, I don't know. I wonder if my viewers are like, just hurry up and beat her. I now did it. I'm pretty sure I could beat her. But financially speaking, was it worth it? Then again, she's hot, so I guess it was worth it. Yes! I did it! Screw six episodes! I did it now! Wow, I only level up once. I kind of thought for sure I'd get a lot more experience out of that. But yes, I did it! Even though it... Is it worth it? Losing one, two, three, four, five demons? Was it worth losing five demons for this? Um... Eh, kind of. Not not really. Because it's, it's going to be stupid expensive. Uh... Wow, I can't even enjoy a victory. It's like, I'm happy. Don't get me wrong. I'm happy I beat her. But it feels like like you're on a road trip and you have to use the bathroom for like the longest time. And you like finally get to go. But it doesn't feel good. Like, it doesn't feel good. It doesn't feel good at all, man. It doesn't, it doesn't feel good. Why doesn't it feel good? Boost my magic. I don't care. You lost, like, a lot of your demons. I know. What am I supposed to do with this? Is it wrong that I feel avenged for the Baja Blast deaths? No. It's not the same. I lost five demons and I lost Sibley. It would have been worth it if I, like, got Cleopatra, but no. It sucks. <laughs> no. How did I... Target is no longer a threat. We've accomplished our objective. Risotto said, but you don't have money for more. I Even if I sell all the stuff, you know, I spend hours farming money. I don't want to do it. But I have to. If I'm going to suffer even further shame, I'd rather die. Uh, so either I let her die or stop her? That's kind of a no-brainer there. What are you doing? Do you intend to steal my freedom to the very end? Yeah. You're like... Too hot to die. Why are you saying bye? 
No, I'm not letting her die. You have your mind. Could it be you're protecting me? Yeah, we can go with that. Yes. I see. All right, then. Abiding the will of the victor is the way of this world. I shall follow under you. Wait, really? Is it just me or is my heart rate rising? Hold on, I'm sorry. I can hear my doctor creaking the door. No, I'm good. I'm good. And I can make Cleo again just in case I lose her. That's... Wait! Where are all your other good skills? You had Mazuma! Wait, 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 wait! I gotta get those back! Oh, you have Luster Candy, though. Raise all allies of all allies by one rank for three turns. Oh! That's so lame! Why is it the thing... Dude! It does a thing in video games where, like, you beat the bad guy, and you're like, Hmm, you beat me, but you make me see the art of my ways. I will join you. I don't even get, like, all the good skills. Man, I could make a better... Oh. I could potentially make a better Cleo. Well, for now, you're staying on the team. You're never leaving this team. At all. Like, you're, like, a dune level. You're not leaving. Ever. So, yeah, I did strip you of your freedom, but I did it! Oh, wait. Actually, I didn't fully do it yet. Hold on, there's one thing left. <sighs> how much does it cost? Just, just tell me. How much does it cost? Uh -huh. Welcome I could theoretically make a Bayer Cleo. But what do I need? To be a little bit stronger. Oh! <laughs> uh, uh, funny, funny how that goes. I could... Theoretically, make a better Cleopatra, and I might actually do that. Well, hold on. Before I go further, I'm going a little too much on this. I want to see. I'm going to register all my demons. Alright. How much would it cost to. Okay, so we got Sibylle, Titania, Pale Rider, Decarabia, Hydra. Remember that, folks. Hydra, Decarabia, Pale Rider, Titania, and Sibylle. Remember that. Because this is part of the challenge. And I'm really starting to hate this challenge more and more and more. This is, oops, really starting to suck. I didn't think it would be this bad, but it really did. Alright, let me see. How much is it? Jesus, you're 75,000? Okay. 39,000. Let's say 40,000. 31,000. That would be 68,000. Let's say 70,000. So still like, what? 78. No, no, sorry. Excuse me. Maybe close to 71,000. Let's say 71,800. Uh, 71,800. Uh, was Pale Rider one of them? Yeah, he was, right? That's 90. Oh my god. Pale Rider was one of them. Oh my god. It's 90,000. That's at least a hundred and sixty thousand dollars already. That's just for those three demons. Takarabi is twenty thousand, so hundred sixty is maybe let's say about close to one eighty four. Let's say one eighty five. Let's round up one hundred eighty five thousand, and then who's the last one? Who's the last demon? Hydra. Maybe how close to that. Oh my God! That means comfortably, I would need two hundred. Maybe two hundred one thousand dollars. I'm definitely glossing over like the change because I'm rounding up, but I need at least two hundred thousand dollars just to get them back. That's essentially a weens of saying I spent two hundred thousand dollars to get Cleopatra. You know what I gotta say to that? Worth it, cause she's flipping hot. Two hundred thousand plus tax. Oh my god, I'm gonna cry. And before I do it. Yes, viewers, I'm not going to cheat. You see this? I'm saving the game. So, in case there's any viewers that are like, you're just going to reload the save. Nope. You saw it proof. I saved it. Which means I can't go back. What happens, happens. Which means, in between this episode and now, I'm going to just... I don't even think I can do that. I think if I sell, like, almost all of my more expensive things, that's still not enough. Oh, there's my moneymaker. Let's find out. All the stuff I'm saving for a rainy day. I guess no better time than present. Stay, stay, 
You will never see me with this much money again. Ugh, that's all my spare stuff. 160,000 is pretty close, but... Oh, I'd have to sell... I don't want to sell my last things. These are like my emergency funds. Like, if I really, like... If I lost, like, a dune and I needed it or something, but... God! Okay, then you know what? I'm gonna have to make some sacrifices. There's some demons I'm just not gonna be able to get. Oh, my God. I should be happy. I got Cleopatra. I should be happy. Why does it not feel good? Why doesn't it feel good, viewers? Tell me! Why am I not happy about this? Ugh. Rest well, Star. Okay. Okay. Let's think smart about this. I am gonna get Sibley back. Sibley is useful. Um... And I do want Pale Rider. Pale Rider is useful, too. Those for sure. Now here's what I'm thinking. I have an idea of yours. The Cleopatra I have, right, is okay. Like, she's got good stuff. But I kind of want to make a better version. So I'm going to keep Cleo for now. But when I get to level 61, I'm going to use this as like... A promise to you all. I'm gonna sacrifice Cleo to make a better Cleo, if that makes sense. Because I think I could theoretically make a better Cleopatra at that level. I really do, because they kind of like really jit me with the whole like, oh yeah, we'll give you Cleopatra, because we know you've been simping for her, or we support her, so. I mean, it's cool, because I got her. Dude, you can go back. But, really, at what cost? It, it didn't feel good. I mean, it feels great. Like, I'm thinking with my other head here. It's just... At what cost? She's crazy hot, but at what cost? I don't know, viewers. Nonetheless, the fact that I did this, I really hope that deserves some kind of support. So, if you thought I did good, please leave a comment. Please, like, tell your friends and family. I... I don't know if I should rename this episode or not. I don't even know what to, like, name this episode. I know I had it a bit for because I was going through the castle, but... I, I don't know. I'm broken here. I think I need to eat. Alright, viewers, this is what I'm going to call it. Oh, wow, it really ended up being a longer video. Wow, huh. I thought this would be a shorter video, but then again, the Cleo thing did it. Anyway, yeah, viewers, I did it. Um, I didn't expect to do it, but I flippin' did it. There is one more DLC I have to do. I know I'm not strong enough for that. I know for a fact. But I'll worry about that later. What I am going to do on the next episode is I didn't technically finish the mission with Cleo. I need to tell that one doctor person I did. So I'm not going to worry about that next episode. So I'm not going to go any further because I want everyone to share the same experience. But I will say on the next episode, and let's honestly think about it. We finished the third area. I got Cleopatra, which was really unexpected. Still got creamed by Huang Long, but I actually think I did pretty damn all right. So on the next episode, I will take that much needed rest. So thank you all for tuning in. Uh, please show your support. Please sub. All that jazz. Like, comment. Uh, what, do, what do other streamers say? Tell your friends. Donate. Whatever. I don't... Just... More or less, just thank you for tuning in. On the next episode, we'll go to Tokyo. I need to, like, take a shower... I need to talk to a therapist because I'm conflicted because I'm like happy that I got Cleo, but I'm broke, which means I'm probably gonna have to do some off-camera farming for money. I'll probably end up doing that in between episodes. Or I'll just worry about it later. You know what? I'm done. I'm shutting this game off. Thank you all for tuning in. I, I'm, I'm spent. I gotta, I gotta call it. So thank you all for tuning in. And man, I wonder, can I raid someone is there one i could raid no one's able to raid i literally click raid channel it says channels you follow nothing all right well oh well, actually i could just raid someone randomly then again most of you guys are probably like calling i don't know do you guys want to get raided or want me to raid someone because i'm probably gonna just pass you on to someone else yeah, let's do it let's give somebody a random raid i want to be fair like that 
I want to... Who's random? I don't even know who's, like, on right now. What's the first thing that pops to mind? Let's say... Apple. Uh... I don't know who to raid. Because I've really done this before. Um... Uh, I typed Apple. The first thing that popped up is some woman named Apple Shampoo who's playing Grand Theft Auto V. You know what? There you go. In case you viewers want to bail, you can. There's a raid for somebody. Enjoy. Otherwise, me personally, I'm calling it here because I, I, I have, like, no energy. So, congratulations, uh, raid, or what is your name? Apple shampoo. I hope you're well. I hope you enjoy it. If you viewers want to tune in, go for her. I don't know what she is. I need to get some food in me. So for me personally, I will see you guys next time. Fare thee well, everybody.